Two former employees are suing the historic Chateau Marmont, claiming the posh hotel is rife with racism and sexual misconduct. Oh, they claim management overlooked people of color for promotions and allowed for a hostile work environment. KCAL 9's Candace Crone talked with one woman about her experience. Nestled on a hill overlooking the Sunset Strip, the famed Chateau Marmont is known as a celebrity getaway where A-listers can let their hair down. Behind the scenes, a former employee says it was a nightmare. I got to a point where I just said enough. This is not okay. Thomasina Gross worked as a banquet server at Chateau Marmont before being let go last March due to the pandemic. She's one of two former employees who have filed a lawsuit against the posh hotel, alleging racial discrimination and sexual harassment. Gross claims management skipped over her for promotions and coveted positions like restaurant server, alleging, quote, most restaurant servers are young, thin, and light-skinned or white, and that, quote, most less desirable positions are filled by workers of color. To then have someone else hired that was white uh, more than one time and then having to basically train them. It was really disheartening. The complaint details one instance where, quote, a male guest would press into Miss Gross's back as she was serving a tray of food to other guests, which happened about twice a month. When she complained to management, she says nothing was done. We shouldn't have to work just as hard for less opportunity to work and less pay and be treated as if our lives are worth less. We allege in the lawsuit that what happened to Tommy was part of a larger pattern and practice of race discrimination at the Chateau. Last September, dozens of Chateau Marmont employees told The Hollywood Reporter in a Zoom meeting that racism and sexual misconduct happened quite often at the Landmark Hotel. Gross says she wanted to share her story to shine a spotlight on the importance of racial diversity, inclusion and safety in the workplace. That's the important thing for me is to change the culture. It's toxic and it's it's just not right. Gross is seeking damages, which include compensation for the loss of salary she would have made if promoted. A spokesperson for the hotel did not get back to us. In West Hollywood, Candace Crone, KCAL 9 News.